Aesop's Fables Fables are short stories that have a moral or message for us. Something to learn and keep in mind as we grow up. Most of the fables have animal characters who think and act just like human beings. It is believed that many of the fables were first told by a wise person called Aesop. Aesop lived hundreds of years ago in a country called Greece. His stories became so popular that people passed them on from generation to generation. Many proverbs and sayings that we use today are based on these fables. Here is one well-known fable. The Stag at the Pool One day, a beautiful stag came to a pool of clear water. As he bent down to drink, he saw his own reflection in the water. He was delighted with what he saw. And instead of drinking water, he kept looking at his own reflection. How handsome I look! He said to himself, How beautiful are these curving antlers? How they add to my beauty? How graceful they look! Then he moved nearer and saw his legs reflected in the pool. He was quite disgusted. Look at my legs! Oh, they're so ugly! All spindly with the small feet. How I wish that nature had given me legs worthy of my stately antlers. As he was brooding in his way, the stag heard an arrow going swish across the pool. At the same time, he picked up the scent of hunters. With a quick turn, he bounded away. His legs carried him swiftly into the forest. The hunters were hot on his trail, but they were no match for his speed. Soon, the stag left the hunters far behind. Safe and out of the hunter's reach, the stag slowed down. Suddenly, without realizing it, he walked into a thicket. There were trees with strong branches growing close together. And alas, the same antlers of which he was so proud got caught in the thick growth. The stag tried to shake himself free. But the more he struggled, the more entangled his antlers got in the branches. Once again, the stag could hear the hunters drawing close and grew afraid. At last, with great difficulty, he managed to free his antlers and bounded away. I realized now that my ugly feet saved my life. I was so proud of these handsome antlers, but they would have been the cause of my death. Very often, we dislike the very things that are most useful to us. Hope you like the story. For more videos, please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching friends. Bye.